I would say the strength in my music would be the melodies. Because I have such a big hobby of mine, just singing constantly. I'm actually, I think I'm humming more than I'm speaking. And uh, sometimes, I know for a fact, people in my surroundings think it's really annoying because they're trying to have a conversation with me. And I'm humming and I hear what they're saying, but I'm still in my head and they're like, oh, you're not listening. But it's because I'm composing constantly and just singing melodies I hear. I never write music thinking of fitting a specific genre, but then if I had to answer, I would say that I write modal jazz alternative. Victor Lewis is a really great jazz drummer, the best one I've ever heard, and he's performed with legends like Stan Getz. He was in Stan Getz's band for 10 years. I really admire him, how, um, how the way he thinks of music in a very spiritual way. And before a gig, he, um, he meditates and just clears his head so he will be able to play from his heart and not just by routine. And we had a project and uh, we started the tour at Fashing with the live radio broadcasting. And it was just, it was such a success. And uh, I really, we decided that we had to record this because we had to capture the moment. My mom actually uh, woke me and my sister up earlier before going to school just so we would have time to uh, listen to music and it would be, it was different music but it was the things I remember the most was Ravel, Debussy and Stravinsky and I think that's been a really big part of how I, what kind of melodies I'm trying to compose because that's been such a huge inspiration for me. always been a really big part of my life and I started with music when I was four years old being in my mother's choir and uh, we were touring around Sweden with it and it was so much fun and uh, the age difference was from 17 till 4 and I was the youngest but I was so serious and I really knew what I wanted to do. I've actually been in CDs before, 
I, my first CD that I was on was when I was nine. Then last year I recorded a CD with my vocal quartet, Åke Vinda. But this is the first album in my own name. And it's uh, my own songs. <laughs> Cause if you fail, I'll 